As you know, cancer is a very broad word and could encompass a, a relatively minor cancer with perhaps no implications or no difference from uh, someone who's otherwise healthy with regards to COVID-19. Uh, to a more extreme situation where a patient with cancer might be facing a situation of a more advanced disease or, or a treatment that might be more immunosuppressive, that is, that would bring the immune system down uh, more than average. And then uh, particularly in those groups of patients, we might think of a different way to approach uh, their care. So we're getting a large number of questions at this point from patients who uh, understandably are concerned and want to understand better uh, what a potential infection with COVID-19 might mean. From what we know, uh, infection with COVID seems to be more difficult, more aggressive, and, and with worse outcomes in people who are in general unwell and are of advancing age. And what we're seeing is this is predominantly in, in older males that we have seen the effect. We don't yet understand all the comorbidities, but what we're telling patients as, as we're getting these questions, that until we know more, it is prudent for them to be extra cautious and, and, and hopefully through, through those behaviors, prevent them becoming infected with, with COVID-19. So be extra careful with regards to the sanitation of your hands, uh, the good practice of social distancing that we have all seen in the news, and certainly try to avoid exposure to individuals who may be potentially uh, ill. Furthermore, some treatments may affect different how, how a person may be able to fight off an infection or not. Uh, some of the treatments that bring down a certain type of uh, white cells uh, create what we call myelosuppression, that is the, the, the neutrophils are down. That is usually thought of to be more important for bacterial infections. Some other uh, cancer treatments may affect more the way our immune system responds and there's a number of cells there like the lymphocytes. So maybe that's more important for viruses, but, but this is all speculative because we really don't have the information at this point.